Yo, what's good? This is St. Joe, MachineTutorials.com. Just want to do a really quick video to show how I like to install third-party machine expansions so that you don't have to wait for the whole rescanning. Because anybody knows when you go in and you add a alias and do all that stuff, it tries to rescan all of your user location. And if you're like me, you got a bunch of different stuff inside a machine, so that can take forever. That's the part I hate about adding stuff. But this is the way I do it, and it gets around that. So basically, you want to go to, let's say, I'm going to do the new uh, C4 traffic from Machine Warehouse. So let me find where I have it on my computer so here's the library here's the folder and basically I just want to import this so instead of going to preferences and adding it and doing all that I just go directly to the folder and I'm gonna do an import and I'm gonna click OK because everything's already tagged so it should just import properly and now I just wait for all the files to import So as you can see, everything imported, like I said, depending on the library, depends on how long it takes, but it's definitely much quicker than doing a rescan. But the thing you want to do, because you'll notice if I go over here, you'll actually see it shows up, but you still want to go over to your preferences, go to your user pass, and add that alias. But now it's not going to do a rescan, so I can just go here, click in C4, and click OK. You see there's no rescanning or anything like that, and I'm pretty much good to go. I can go in and start loading the different sounds that I want now, and it's all good to go. So that's how I import third-party libraries. Like I said, I do this for drum kits, expansions, anything that's third-party that doesn't come with its own installer directly from machine. This is how I like to import it. So I don't go through the whole, you know, go into the file, go to preferences, and then add the user, you know, add the path, and then add the alias. Because when you do it that way, it's going to, you have to click rescan. And what it does is it rescans everything in your library, which takes forever especially the more stuff you have in here the longer it's going to take so hopefully in the future they make it so you can just add it and just have it you know rescan whichever library you're adding but right now it doesn't work that way so that's why i do it the way i do it like i said you just go to disk import the folder you don't have to worry about adding any tags or anything let it import all the samples and then once it's done you want to go into your preferences and add the alias to that library and you'll be good to go so of course if you got any questions let me know this is st joe machine tutorials.com showing you how to import third-party expansions without having to wait for the dreaded rescan taking four five six eight hours or however it long it takes depending on how much content you have machine referencing in your user location so again let me know if you got any questions rate comment subscribe share all that good stuff i'll see y'all later peace